In this short clip, we'll take a look at the Member Groups tool in Elite Bridge Deal Connect. The Member Groups tool uh, is similar to a framing plan on a structure. Essentially, we're going to define uh, where the beams are located. Basically, the center lines of the beams are on the structure. Now, before we can start doing this, we first have to create what we call a group. So I'm just going to click on this folder icon and that will create a new group. If you want to rename it, you can click on it and do so. Uh, but typically, you may only have one group on a, on a simple structure, so that's really all you need. Next, I'll select the uh, back and ahead reference. So I'm going to do this as a continuous beam bridge. So by specifying the first and last support, that's inferring to the software that this is a continuous beam over support 2. I'm going to tell it that I have four girders and by default it equally spaces those out. Now the outer girders are placed adjacent to or coincident with the left and right edge of slab. So if you want to change that to some other value uh, you can simply key in a, a different value for the left and right edge like so and then again it will equally space uh, the interior beams uh, based on that. There are other options here. Um, if you need to, uh, you can tell the software that these are independent beam paths and that will allow you to control the spacing at each end of them. And then we also have something called a custom beam path. And that's where you import in from a microstation drawing the uh, elements that represent the center lines of the beams and this allows you to have let's say curved beams on a partially tangent alignment or something like that so it allows you to be completely independent of uh, the alignment itself as opposed to parallel to it or, or relative to it with the independent method this is also where you'll tell the software uh, whether you're doing an eye girder or a tub girder structure once you have all this filled out, select OK, and that will update the bridge model. Um, nothing really shows up graphically, uh, but once you define the members in the member definition window, then uh, those beams will show up as part of the 3D model. Thank you for watching this clip on member groups in Leap Bridge Steel Connect.